Today, I will be showing you how you can make your own rolling system, diving system, and double jumping system, just like the RB Battles Roblox game in Roblox Studio. So if you want to know how you can make this in Roblox Studio, make sure that you watch this video all of the way to the end to find out exactly how to make this. Hey guys and welcome back to this brand new tutorial on my YouTube channel and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you exactly how you can make a rolling system, a double jumping system and a diving system just like in the RB Battles Roblox game. This is what we're going to be recreating in Roblox today. It is pretty simple uh, as I would say it myself. But of course, I am making a tutorial on it for you guys, so if you do in fact enjoy this tutorial already, and you want to support me, then give this video a like if you like it, and if you don't like this video, please drop a dislike on the video, because honest feedback really helps me out a lot. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, turn on the notification bell, become a member, do anything you want to support me. So without further ado, let's hop right into the tutorial. So newbie, what do we do? Great question. You First of all, you are going to the link in the description. You are getting the model from the link in the description. And then you are coming back to Roblox Studio. So do that right now. Get the model. Come back. And then we can continue. So now you got the model. We can go to View at the top over here. We can go to Toolbox. And then we can go on the four blocks over here. Uh, like that one. And then we can get the DDD Tutorial Newbie. So let's press on that. Okay, there it is. If you're wondering why it's DDD, because I, I, I initially initially I thought it was Duck Dive and Dash, but that wasn't really the case. But I did not update it yet, so don't worry about that. Anyways, um, you will see two animations over here, and these are two animations you are going to need. Um, disclaimer, I am not an animator, so the animations are a little bit goofy. <laughs> they are pretty bad, but you can always make your own. It really doesn't matter. If you're not an animator, you can use my animations, my, my trash animations. And if you're an experienced animator, just go ahead and make your own in Blender or whatever. So first of all, create a script in Start Your Character Script, like this. And then name it Client. Uh, now before we do anything, go over here, Dive Animation. Then click on, uh, right click it. Like, like right click it. Then come down to Save to Roblox. Then you're going to get this pop-up view. I'm just going to call it a Tutorial Dive Animation. Uh, lol. Creator, me, yep, and uh, just click submit, and then get that ID. So, let's put it in already. Uh, let's just do this real quick. So, dive anim is that, and then roll anim. And we're going to need these IDs, so we're just going to write them up real, real quick. So, roll animation, same thing, save to Roblox. Roll animation tutorial, XD, submit, copy the ID, close. And then this is our ID for the role animations. You cannot use my IDs. It will not work. You have to do your own. This is why I'm giving you the actual key to the animations. So all you have to do is upload them to Roblox and then you're good. So now let's get coding on this thing. Uh, I will show you how to code everything. So keep on watching and enjoy.
So that right there was all of the coding done for this tutorial. So now we have entered the recap section and I'm going to be briefly explaining to you what the code does. So the people who want to learn something can actually learn something. So over here we are requesting the user input surface. We are defining a character and getting the humanoid of it. We are creating animations and giving them animation IDs. Well, uh, like with the animations we just created. We are doing uh, three variables over here, has double jumped, has dashed, and debounce. Uh, we're going we're, we're gonna to use all of them in any way. I think we don't, but that doesn't matter. Anyways, a uh, previous jump is equals to tick, so uh, in that way we can determine if you can double jump or not. We are loading animations. If you're pressing left shift uh, and you're not uh, like flying, you're not jumping, then you're just going to roll because that's how the game works. And then over here, we are making sure you actually, like, get pushed in front of you. And then we are stopping some animations and removing you from actually um, stopping, you know. And then over here, we are... Well, if you are jumping and then you try to uh, press left shift, then we will enable a dive animation. We will set the body... We're going to do the body velocity thingy again. And then what we can do is we can, uh, over here, we can give you another velocity. We're going to do times 0.7. And then the roll animation is going to play. The dive animation is going to stop. Because when you land, we are going to make sure you are going to roll. Uh, we're going to stop you from, like, moving automatically. And after 0 0.8 seconds, we are going to stop you from, uh, no, we are going to stop the roll animation. And then debounce is equal to false. We're just checking the state changed over here. If you've landed, then you can double jump again. And if you're jumping, we're going to calculate. And then jump request is when you try to jump. And then we're going to try that. So this is basically the script. And now we can test this out. So I'm loading in the game right now, and which means I can actually test. So what we're going to do now is um, we're going to test it. So what we can do is first of all we are gonna do left shift so um in just a second okay three two one left shift as you can see we just rolled in front of us y you saw that right so if we just do this okay left shift three two one left shift boom we are rolling we are getting forward as you can see sometimes the animation breaks a little bit but that is kind of my animation or roblox's fault yeah, it's probably just uh, because I'm moving. Yeah, it's because I'm moving. If you just do that, and as you can see, that actually works. If I okay, let's try double jumping. Three, two, one, double jump. Okay, double jumping actually works. As you can see, we can just double jump. Nice. But what if we do left shift over here? As you can see, we just roll. Pretty usual, right? So now, what if we just try to dash or dive, whatever? We can just do a uh, double jump, so uh, or, or one time. So I'm going to double jump and then dive. Three, two, one, double jump, dive. And as you can see, when we land, I'm going to do a roll. So as you can see, it actually works. This, this is actually similar to RB Battles. This is how RB Battles also kind of did it. And I just replicated it pretty easily. So if you did, in fact, enjoy this tutorial on my YouTube channel and you're new to my channel, whatever, make sure you support me by subscribing. Like the video if you like it. If you don't like it, drop a dislike on the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, turn on the notification bell, become a member, do anything you want, and all I can say is that my name is Newbie, and I say, peace out.